everyone, it's Akila. Welcome or welcome back to my channel and I'm so excited because right now I'm standing in front of Plenial Pumpkins and Orchard because the Halloween Bloxburg update just dropped. I don't even have the update log yet, but let's just go ahead and get into it because we have been waiting for this one. We did get Plenial Pumpkins and Orchard for the very first time last year. But this little stand right here, Sabrina Snacks, is something that is new and I can't wait to check it out. I do see some of the new items already. And we see the corn maze over there, so we're gonna try to complete that again. Hopefully we can get another plaque or trophy. I think it was a plaque. And then we have the barn. We'll go through that in a second. Tom and the Beat Builders are back for their world tour. I can't wait to hear their music. And here's the play area for all the kids and me. And then if we go through here, looks like we can get some more fall treats. Probably the stuff that we can't get at Sabrina's. And then last but not least, we have the pumpkin patch, which is still so cute and probably my favorite part. Okay, that was a little overview. And now let's go check out Sabrina's snacks i do have my sounds off right now because tom and the bee builders are a little loud over there like who are they performing for but it's okay so oh my gosh look at we have the popcorn machine which we already had but i think it was reworked so we could have kettle corn i think that's kettle corn and then this is the cotton candy machine oh my goodness something tells me the cotton candy machine is going to cost blocks bucks but we'll have to see when we go in build mode later so <gasps> We can buy a corn dog, buttered popcorn, kettle corn, an orange -o lantern cotton candy, a spooky strawberry cotton candy, pumpkin ice cream sandwich, and of course, witch's brew, which is probably at the grocery store, the BFF supermarket. So let's make sure. Okay, so let's take a look at the town really quickly. Of course, it's decorated for Halloween. It looks like the NPCs are dressed up too. The witch's brew can be found at the BFF supermarket again. We can also buy pumpkins from here again, and they still have not fixed this janky gray pumpkin, but I guess that's just gonna be a thing now. We just got the mini corn dogs not too long ago and now we have the regular size corn dogs which is awesome <gasps> look that is so cool okay i'm gonna put that down let's just we have to buy everything but i don't think we can like place it all down right here which kind of sucks but we have popcorn in this little um container of course the, this is the buttered popcorn and then we can get the kettle corn, which is in a brown container, and it is so cute. I love this. Comment down below if you like kettle corn better than regular popcorn. Next, we have the orange cotton candy. It looks a little doo-doo brown to me, but I'll leave it alone. And then um, this is the witch's brew that we got last year. Delicious. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Next, we have the pumpkin ice cream sandwich, which is it's cute it's cute i don't know if i'd eat that in real life but it looks cute in bloxburg and then this is the spooky strawberry cotton candy which is probably my new favorite item <laughs> so yeah um thank you so much sabrina um love the outfit by the way and now we can go through the little archway and we have the whole little setup where you can sit down with your friends and family or by yourself like me and you can eat your snacks you can hang out and talk and tom and the beat builders let's turn on the sounds really quickly to see see what music they're playing this year okay all right That actually went pretty well. Okay, bye guys. I have to go. I have to go. I have to go. Please, their music is haunting me. There's no need for us to go over there. So let's go back here. I can still hear them. Oh my goodness. Uh, I think these are all from last year. That would make sense. All these items are from last year and then... The ones at Sabrina's stand are all new. Now, let's head over here to the little pumpkin patch. And we have plenty of pumpkins. 
where we can also buy pumpkins and they'll go straight to your inventory if you buy them from here or the um, BFF supermarket. There is this little wagon and you can walk around and pretend you're picking out pumpkins. So let's, oh wait, we have, a, we have the wheelbarrow too. I'm pretty sure you can sit in the wheelbarrow. I don't have anyone here with me, but I think that's, I think that's a theory. I think that's a good theory too. But let's see if we can complete this maze. Uh, I know everyone is like talking about how hard the Royal High maze is, and I would definitely not try that out because I was stressed out with this one. So we're just gonna wing it, and we're gonna see what happens. I'm just gonna run for my life. What the heck? I'm already stressed. I can't do this. Wait, this is the entrance. Okay, maybe we have to go this way. No, stop. Say psych right now. Well, I'm back at square one because the server updated again for like maintenance, and I'm a little, I'm a little mad about that. We will get through it. We will. Wait, because I literally feel like I'm almost there. Let's go this way and through here. Oh my, let's go. Let's go. We got the, we got the plaque. We got the plaque. We got the plaque. And I think we have finished what we were supposed to do here. So now we can leave this place. Wait, I need to get one more thing. Let me get another corn dog. Yeah. All right, now we can go. I'll tell you one thing, my car better not get towed, but we just made it to this little graveyard thing again, and it pretty much looks the same, so yeah, nothing too crazy going on over here. And the Ferris wheel actually has some Halloween colors going on and some spooky spiders. Oh yeah, and right over by Lovely Lumber, uh, we still have the dead man in the water, so yeah, that's, that's a little scary, Coeptus. Now let me get back to my vehicle before it gets towed away. The last place we're stopping before we check out build mode is um, Plenty of Pumpkin Stand located in the town. It says, come visit us at our new farm located next to the campground. And you can, a pumpkin, a, a, a pumpkin spice hot chocolate. <gasps> Wait, that is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh my goodness. I, I love this. I love this. This is my new favorite, like, treat. The rest of the stuff, basic, average. I'm going home. Okay, so I am back at my house, and I have not decorated for fall yet, but it's coming. Don't worry. Um, let's check out... What do I even want to do? Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's go to build mode first. Of course, we have the new and special category. Um, we have this... Whoa, wait, let's go over here. There's a pop-up tent. I'm not even gonna worry about color and everything. We have a rake. Where was, we have to put this against the wall, I'm guessing. All right, let's put the rake um, just right over here. We'll figure it out. Um, then we have this rough autumn tree. <gasps> wait, the leaves are falling. Why did I say it like that? Um, okay. Wow. Uh, did not see that coming. Then, if we go to decorate, we have new and special. So, uh, let's... Oh my goodness, there's so much to get into. Okay, inflatable candy corn. Adorable. Love that. Using that. Uh, metal leaf tray. Um, I need a table to place some stuff down on. But we have... We have all this stuff. I knew these were gonna cost blocks bucks. I freaking knew it, dude. So yeah, um, yeah, I need a table. I need a table, stat. All right, I got my little table and now we can go back and wait, what was, what was I doing? Oh, this, okay. Let's put this there and then we have this, all these things. That is kind of cute. I kind of like that. Uh, let's make the grid smaller. Ooh, those are kind of, kind of spooky looking. Kind of giving, um, the Haunted Mansion. Oil lamp. All right. Let me just readjust those. A fall wreath. I'm putting that on the door. What? Say less. Okay, that is adorable. Wait, I also just learned that we can resize pumpkins too. So that's fun. That's ginormous. 
kind of ridiculous, but <laughs> let's just move that over here for now. All right, and now let's go to the special category. And we have all the stuff we got last year. Um, yeah, basic stuff. Um, stuff that isn't new. We can leave that stuff alone. You guys get the point. Do want to see if there's more candy though. So let's actually grab this and see if there's more candy in the bucket. I guess I'll show one thing in case you guys weren't here last year. Okay, so basically you can deflate and inflate the inflatables. So that's a cute little feature. And we have the candy cauldron and like candy bowls and stuff. Uh, it looks like all these are the same candies from last year, which makes sense because there's a lot of them. But if you grab a little candy bucket thingy, you can actually grab them and it'll go inside your bucket. So that's fun. It just fills up all the way and you can eat candy from the bucket. Then we have this like leaf tray, which is, it's cute. I don't know if I'd really use it. Maybe I will. I have no idea. This is the countertop um, cotton candy where we have like, we can make a regular cotton candy. So that's fun. And then we have the big one that costs Flox Bucks. So let's just use that. It's a pretty quick action. So at least it doesn't take forever. And then we have the tall popcorn like maker, like the ones you see at movies and carnivals and stuff. <gasps> There's cheese popcorn! They didn't sell that at the, um, at Plenty of Pumpkins, I think. Wait, that is, okay, wait. I have to fill it up, and then we can just take some. That is so fun! Wait, was there another one that I missed? Okay, um, so we have buttered kettle, cheese, and caramel. Okay, wait, caramel! That one is new, too! Wait, so one of them is, oh! Oh my goodness, I thought this one was kettle corn, but oh, okay, 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 I see, I see, I see. Well, that is so cool, and um, then we have all these like little candles and stuff, which is nice, and this pop-up tent, I wanted one of these for so long because the big one we have is just like ginormous, but um, yeah, this is fun. It's the perfect size for a small casual event, and let's grab this rake and if we use it um on this leaf pile i mean i'm guessing okay so we're raking that's it oh okay they're all gone i was like this is taking a while so here are the new donuts as well as the cake pops these are adorable i love them well that's gonna be it for this video i did actually see the update log now like it just came out and it says Happy fall, added fall, and Halloween themed items, foods, and locations. Re-added plenty of pumpkins and orchard farm. Added popcorn and cotton candy machines. Added ability to resize pumpkins. Added ability to push carry player in a wheelbarrow. Here's a picture from Twitter that I saw. Then it also says added neighborhood allow list setting. Raise neighborhood player limit to 75. And last but not least, made your bug fixes. So let me know what your favorite part of this Halloween update is. Do not forget to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!